Hello everyone. It's an honor and pleasure to tell you what you already know. Medical school at the University of Minnesota is a phenomenal place. I've been here 30 years now and uh, I have this gut level loyalty to the science, to the clinical care, to the education that medical school provides. And this is why. It's all about the people. It's not, as me sometimes think, about the people that are living in the present alone. It's not just about the people that we know and who we are. It's about the people who preceded us, who laid the foundation for us to achieve what we can to the limits of our potential. And it's also the people who come after us, who can be unborn yet. And this tripartite, this, this ability to encompass the history of medicine as well as its future is in your hands. All of you have several attributes that are incredibly important. One is hard work. The second is honesty, the integrity in everything that we do. And the third one is what anchors us all is helping others. And the whole medicine is built on alleviation of human suffering. Everything we do can be encaptured in two words, academic medicine. Academic medicine is not pipettes and the beakers in the lab. It's really the future that you give to someone in the operating room or in the clinic because of the discoveries, the science, what underlines their injury or their disease. So the way we have moved from these foundational discoveries to say the ECMO, which is the lung and heart machine that we are now able to put in a small vehicle and soon on a rotary on fixed wing, that is the trajectory that we are taking. We teach, we innovate, we heal. And the outcome of this is very intentional. We are here to deliver exceptional physicians for the state of Minnesota, for the nation, internationally. We are here to provide the discoveries to have the highest quality outcomes. But the practical angle of that is that we see that patient in the middle of this. It is that complexity of that environment and that connection, that distributed brain, that network knowledge, that multi-layered ability to communicate with each other. Fluent in basic science, accomplished in clinic and operating room, phenomenal master, teacher, people like you make that system work all together. It is with hope that I look for the next years and decade of this medical school because we've got it. We've got the people who can do it. And we've got each other, and we have the obligation, the responsibility, and this existential ability to make a choice about ourselves so that we can act with agency and autonomy in the years to come.